it's all, it's also stunning the lack of anger from the American people, the, the apathy and the sort of just acceptance that even though it has been deemed illegal what the NSA was doing, that he exposed illegal activity, that they still would punish him if they caught him. And everybody's like, huh, you know. So, like, what is government then? If government is a group of people that are allowed to do something that has absolutely been deemed illegal by the courts, and if you catch them doing this illegal thing and then report it, and everyone agrees that it's wrong, everyone agrees it's unconstitutional, but yet, if they get you, they will still put you in jail. Like, what the fuck is Not government? What is government then? Right, but... Not only that, right? Not only is the person who exposes what are crimes, what courts have said are crimes, not only is that person punished as though they've done something wrong, when in reality they're owed the gratitude, right, of the entire country for stopping criminal spying by the government on our population domestically, which was one of the primary preoccupations of the American Revolution. Yes. That was what the founding was about. It was about, you know, the king not being able to send his goons into your house and into your neighborhoods and search through your papers unless they had a, a, a proven reason to do so approved by a court. That's what Snowden demonstrated, told all of us the government was doing to us, not to the terrorists, not to pat it to all of us. Yeah. Not only is it that he's been punished for having blown the whistle on criminality when he deserves a parade down Fifth Avenue. What's so much worse is that the people who broke the law haven't paid any price. They're not, they don't have charges against them. Nothing. In fact, they remain in government. The, the thing that made Snowden finally commit the last kind of the straw that broke his, his, his back as, as, it, as, as it were was when James Clapper, President Obama's senior national security official, he ran the entire national security apparatus as the director of uh, national intelligence, went before the Senate and was asked explicitly, does the US government, does the NSA collect dossiers and tons of information on millions of Americans? And he looked at the senator who asked him that and said, no, sir, not wittingly. That's a crime. That's a felony just to lie to the Senate, let alone to do it. And not only was James Clapper never prosecuted, he was never fired. He served out his term as President Obama's senior national security official. And you know where he works now? He works at CNN, disseminating the news to <laughs> the American public after he got caught fucking lying about the most important question he's ever been asked. Um, that's, you know, that's how you know that you live in a country that despite the facade of democracy has gone very very off course you know like the, the one